Yo guys, Delirious Sanity here again and today I've got another mod review for you and this one is called Piero Pedro. Um, I believe this is uh, made in Japanese but um, the guy says here in the description I understand English a little. Base damage times two on assault and combat shotgun. Original weapon has not changed but you can find this weapon here in uh, right outside of Vault 111 so there is Vault 111 you come into this little office here and you've got the two shot and the explosive so they both have their own um, special uh, legendary so let's go see how much damage these guys can do against the death claw Oftentimes I forget I do not have the fucking jetpack. Alright, so let's check these weapons out. The explosive uh, assault uh, machine gun. Damage is at 125. It shoots a 556. Five, Speaking of that, I have none of the ammo, so I'm going to grab some real quick. And the other one shoots a 4 to 5. And since it shoots an additional project, uh, projectile. It does 242 damage, and I do have a little bit of 45, but I'm going to grab some more. Alright, now let's actually test the rifles out. It is a single shot. So, it's not OP, but it does do some pretty good damage. That explosive definitely helps. So let's try that here. Do that five five six smash into that death cause fucking face. Back off, death call. He's hurt. He's down for the count. Although VATS does work well, I would recommend using, uh, not using VATS here on this one because, uh, Seems like, um, I can kill it quicker without using that. But anyway, let's go on to the next one, which is uh, going to be a bit more strong. It's the uh, 45 uh, combat rifle. Shoots an additional projection projectile, and uh, the damage is at 242, so let's check that. So obviously a lot quicker of a kill. Let's check out that here. Ah, oh, 
than you have to finish them off in vats, but this one does work a lot better in vats, which is useful because um, I oftentimes like to use vats. Now let's go see what kind of customizations we can do to them. Can we edit the legendaries that are on them? Can we change it around? What can we do here? Let's go check them out. So we can obviously put on the um, advanced receiver, which pops this one up to 208. The vented barrel. Nice stock, a drum round. We'll keep that how it is. A muzzle brake. And you can take the legendary off and um, with UCO obviously. Which is nice. I guess the powerful automatic receiver does the most damage. And of course you can take the legendary off. And this one does the max at 328. That's full auto, so you're gonna get some pretty uh, pretty high damage per second. And you can um, rename them obviously. Which is nice, because they are written in Japan. I mean Japanese. But anyway guys, uh, I appreciate you watching. Subscribe and check out my channel, and I will catch you in the next one. Enjoy your mods and enjoy your day guys. Peace out.